Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary box, providing expert analysis, is Stuart Robson. And we have action from Liga Uber Eats coming right up for you. It's Stade Prestois against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out, who will affect the game, and who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. The lineup then for the hosts. Well, it's a 4 3 3 formation with a centre forward and two wingers. So it's important that the midfield players give support to the striker whenever the ball goes wide. They can't allow him to be isolated. And here is the initial 11 for Paris Saint Germain. Gianluigi Donnarumma begins in goal. Sergio Ramos plays alongside Marquinhos in central defence. Marco Verratti starts alongside Fabian in central midfield. And in attack today, Kylian Mbappe starts with Lionel Messi. A potentially exciting match in store, and it's Paris Saint-Germain who kick off. Realising that it might be opening up on the opposite flank. Minch. Messi. Messi. Putting his body on the line. He's in here. Takes on the shot. Well, I must admit, it didn't trouble the keeper to the extent that I thought it might. Messi, that is a tackle and a half. I would imagine, Stuart, in the pre-match team meeting, the defenders would have been told to keep an eye on Neymar. Well, Derek, when he's on form, when he's focused, He's a brilliant runner with the ball. He can take on players. He can go past people with ease. And he's got a great shot on him as well. I'm really looking forward to watching him play today. Messi. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. And forward this time goes Neymar with options aplenty. Lionel Messi. Can he open the door to a potential goal? Oh, fine stop. Fired in by Neymar. Well cleared away. Can they forge ahead? No, chance missed. And a big chance at that, Derek. He should have put them in the driving seat there. Kamara. Well, PSG doing well to regain control of the ball. Mbappe. Well kept out. It's Neymar's corner, and he clears the danger. Safe pair of hands, did his job. 
Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. He's enjoying space. Really vital interception here. Mbappe. Les Melou. Mounier. And a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Mbappe. Lionel Messi. Mbappe. Well, it didn't happen for them in attack. Lionel Messi. High quality defending. Now, counter attacking possibilities here. Mbappe. Verratti now. Kimpembe. Well, sloppy in possession. Belkebla. Camara. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. And we will have just one additional minute. Oh, good looking run. And tremendous goalkeeping. Well, he just made it so difficult for the striker. His presence alone just caused him a problem. The delivery from Neymar. Excellent block. And so it is. The first half story has been written. Well, here's something we don't say terribly often. Lionel Messi has been a long way from his best. Not making his mark in this game, Stuart. Well, he's been off the pace so far. He's struggled to get on the ball. He's not looked threatening. And his movement just hasn't been good enough. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Honora. No space for them here. And whipped into the box. Not away completely. Not a time for composure on the ball. Marco Verratti. Fabian. Counter-attacking, very much an option. It's looking promising. And a significant block following. And the referee's verdict is penalty kick. This to make it 1-0. And the penalty is converted. A goal it is. And now he can exhale. Well, as you can see, the keeper just stands still and the ball's hit down the side of him. It's a strange one in the end. And back in business, advantage, PSG. Honora, onto Lemelou. Now that pass easy on the eye. 
when it comes to nothing in the end offside well he doesn't need to make his movement quite so quickly there just let the ball be played into the space they will now make use of the substitutes bench Fabian and possession lost intercepted my goodness, it looked as though he was clean through. And the referee, what will he do here? And a red card it is. Denial of a clear goal-scoring opportunity. Well, as soon as he made the tackle, he knew the outcome. That's an easy decision for the referee. And time for the change now. And never in any doubt from the keeper. Lala. Could be dangerous. Well, the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. And he was in the right place to intercept. Messi. Well, that effort was always going wide. He's not going to be best pleased with himself. Honora. Well, borderline offside, but correct. Twenty minutes remaining. Oh, big chance! Defending of the highest class to stop him. Getting forward. Verratti. Verratti! Well, the keeper kept it out with a minimum of fuss, but it wasn't a great effort. Les Melou. Jean Kevin Duvert. Determined defending. And threading it forward. Lionel Messi! And there it is! A two goal cushion now. And they just need to keep the concentration. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And what a clever bit of play it was from Messi, both with his movement and his finish. That's a nice goal. And the ball is moving again. 2-0 is how it stands. There's Malou. Could cross it in here. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Can he get one back? He can! And who's to say there's not enough time for them to level matters? It would be quite the story. Well, here's the replay. It all starts with the delivery into the box. Just begging someone to get on the end of it. And then what a strike. The lovely half volley. It's so difficult to keep these down. This is a very tidy finish. Well, underway again. It's a narrow 2-1 lead as things stand. And 
And with that, the attack fizzles out. It will be a Paris Saint-Germain free kick. Well, three minutes of stoppage time added on here. The keeper was never likely to be in trouble then. Mbappe. And they need to get tighter here. This could finish it. And in all likelihood, that is game over. So little time left for a response. Well, it's great awareness of space in the box. And then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. And there's the final whistle, and we can confirm a victory for Paris Saint-Germain. What did you think of their overall display? Well, Derek, they were dominant in most aspects of the game, particularly in that midfield area, and they also looked threatening in the top third of the pitch. It's a really good result for them. Well, it's always an enjoyable experience watching Neymar. Your verdict on his performance? Well, I have to say, that was impressive. Not just his goals, but his all-round play. He was excellent.